Hi, I'm Invalid Ghost, and today we're gonna play The Sims 3. We are with Bean and Dell and the and their dog Eric. And finally, guys, we have graduated from university, so now Bean and Dell are on their own, living at this beautiful home, which I yes, I decorated it a little bit further, you know. It, I kind of embellished the detail the the outside i i prettied it up i added some terrain paint i got being a car did bean already have a car i don't remember but i bought being a car we got some lights yeah i think he already had the car but i put the asphalt down which is nice right i think we didn't i don't think i put a grill here last time so we got a grill we got two chairs a football you know, there's some nice little detailing. We got a bush, a tree, some more, some detailed grass on the ground. A lot of stuff. Anyway, on the inside, I did add a few little details, you know, around the house. You might be able to, to notice them. Uh, like, I, I decorated the bathroom a little bit more. I got Bean this little dragon toy, because... He likes dinosaurs, and I mean, it's it's a dragon, but, you know, it, it looks like a dinosaur if you squint. I got Be Del, I almost called her Belle, god dang it. I got Del a little freezer bunny toy, because it's cute looking, I don't know, it, it went with the pink theme that I'm going for. I also got her a chainsaw. <laughs> anyway, she also has this pet fish named Dorm, it's a minnow. She caught that while fishing on the roof, so at the dorm, so that's why I named it Dorm, so that we don't forget where we got it. It's probably gonna die, to be honest. We have to feed this thing, it's definitely going to die. Dorm is going to die, <laughs> and I'm sorry in advance. I think I might have a mod where they live a bit longer, but I, I, it probably will die. I'm just saying. I don't think I added anything else here, except maybe this death note notebook. Um, I put the potions that were in Dell's inventory on this counter. I don't know what to do with them. If we should use them or toss them. They're, I can't sell them for anything, so... I, I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do with that. Uh, also, these images are broken! <laughs> there. Okay, good. Slideshow's still going. Alright, um... I added a few little wall decals. You know... Just just some little decorations here and there. Nothing crazy. Um, yeah, anyway, let's just begin. Let's start. So, Bean, you want to join the law enforcement career. So guess what, buddy? You can finally do that. So let's go find the... Oh, I turned music off. It's a good thing I caught that. Otherwise, we'd have a boring experience, huh? <laughs> anyway, you wanted to be a... What do you want to be again? International super spy. Okay. And you want to go through the special agent branch. Okay. Let me just remind myself. Special agent. Special agent. Because that's going to be important later. Sometime soon. Maybe not soon. Later down the road. Where is the... Uh, the hex the police building? Is it at the... City Hall. Register as retired. Yep. <laughs> I'm retired. I found the criminal building. Oh, my ghost. Where's the... Other building? Okay. Oh, I found it. Thank God. Okay, there it is. Join law enforcement career. Jesus, that took a while. Let's visit it. Join investigator pr profession. That sounds more interesting, to be honest. But no, this is law enforcement. Okay. Meanwhile, Dell, you want to move in with Clark. But guess what? I just built this beautiful house, and there ain't no room for Clark. So he ain't ha he ain't coming unless he wants to sleep on the couch. <laughs> so we're not doing that just yet. But I'll keep it there for later, for future reference, when we get enough money to move out into a bigger house. Or maybe we will have Clark move in and he can sleep on the couch, because I'm, I'm not going to care about him at all. <laughs> oh, also I got Bean a guitar, because he wants to learn the guitar skill. It has a dragon on it, because um, I, I couldn't fit the dinosaur print on it. Uh, it just didn't look good, because no dinosaurs were in clear view, so... Uh, yeah. Anyway, 
Look at him! Bean's driving his own car! Isn't that great? It's neon yellow! I was- I was thinking about putting the dinosaur pattern on the car, but I thought, mm, that's a little too much dinosaur fun, <laughs> so I just made it yellow. <laughs> I mean, we already got the bed dinosaur. He's wearing a dinosaur shirt. We don't need any more dinosaur print stuff. Okay. The presence of crime is evident in all societies, and it's up to a few brave sims to protect and serve. The law enforcement career requires peak physical conditioning, shrewd analytical abilities, the right attitude, and close ties with a partner. Okay, he's gonna be a patrol officer. Uh, what level is that? What level are you starting at? Four! Okay, cool. Bean got a new job. My boss is my sister! <laughs> Why? I guess she was in the law enforcement career. I can't remember why. She did have a police car in her driveway for some reason, so... You know, I, I guess that makes sense. Oh my god. Abby is Bean's boss. That's really weird. Okay. I still don't know why she's in the law enforcement career, but I don't know. Maybe it was her want or something, and I just decided to do it. I have no idea. But whatever. I gotta do reports, and I gotta have a partner. Who is my partner? My boss is my sister, but who's my partner? Kelly Woobles is my partner. Okay. Abby's my boss and I don't like her. Why don't I like my sister? I'm pretty sure our relationship was higher than that, but you know what? Whatever. Um, She's a snitch. Ooh. And Abby is a wiretap reader. Okay. I think it might have reset our relationship because she's my boss now. Which is kind of stupid, but whatever. Okay, how about you uh, chat with her on your phone? You know, make friends, make nice. We, we are not doing well. Uh, our status is bad, so that's not good. <laughs> and you need to do reports. Get info by questioning any sim in town or by digging through their trash. Okay, we can dig through some trash, but later. Del, I don't know why you're eternally faithful. Faithful, that's so irritating. Okay. Del, you don't have a job. You're just a bum right now, but that's okay. We will go to China when we get enough cash to go to China. Right now, we definitely do not have China cash, as you can see. So we're just going to hang out, uh, get to know our dog. How about you teach Eric how to sit? You know, teach him some tricks. Because I don't want to just ignore the dog. I was going to go on a date with Clark, but man, we've done that so many times. Let's do something a little different. Let's actually care about our dog. Let's train him. Sit. Do you know how to sit? It sounded like she said stay, which is definitely not the right trick, Del. Luba. 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 Wibble. Yeah, I don't think he's getting it. You gotta, You got to show him the action. Well, I mean, she did show him the action, but I mean, you gotta, you gotta really show him. Uh, I've actually, fun fact, I've taught all of my cats how to sit. Every single one. All three of them. Of course, two of them have now passed away. But I taught all three sit. Um, and I taught the other two, the ones that passed, a few more tricks than that, but this... This, my youngest cat, who's now my only cat, Squishy... That's not his real name, that's a fake name, but, uh... Squishy only knows Sit, and I just recently taught him, because he never wanted to eat treats before. But, uh, and he, now he eats treats, now that the other two cats have passed. I don't, I don't know what was up with that. I think he's, he's really a gentleman, you know? Squishy's a gentleman. I think he didn't eat the treats before, because he liked to watch the other cats eat the treats. Either that or he's a bit of a coward. I don't I don't know. He would beg for the treats though. He would beg for the treats, but not for himself. He would beg for the other two. He was a weirdo. <laughs> but it was sweet. And you know, he's really taken both of their deaths really hard. I can tell. It's like his whole personality changed when Valid went. It's real sad. I mean he struggled with, with Invalid's death, but when Valid passed Oh, he turned into a whole nother cat. And that's why I, taught, I was able to teach him sit, I guess. But anyway. Um, yeah, I taught the other two other trip, uh, other tricks. Like, I taught uh, invalid jump and spin. And then valid new up, sit, lay down. 
you know, they, they know a handful of tricks. Nothing crazy or anything, but... <sighs> anyway... I'm gonna teach this dog how to sit. <laughs> the the be the easiest sit. how I taught my cats how to sit is uh, I would just well for Valid it was really easy. She just kind of seemed to know what to do as soon as I got her. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know. I guess maybe her previous owner might have taught her sit, but I didn't even know sh if she had a previous owner because we found her by a dumpster and she was really young, just a few months old. All right. Anyway. To, te to teach my cat sit, I would just uh, pat them on the on the rear to get them to to sit, and then I give them the treat. I don't know if you do that with dogs. I don't even know if you're supposed to do that with cats, but that's how I tr taught my cats how to sit. Pat them on the rear, say sit, <laughs> and then they eventually learn that sit means to sit. All right, Bean, I'm gonna go hang out with you for a second. You're still chatting with Kelly? Alright, how about you and Kelly? Uh... Do some work together. Invite her out. Invite her out so you guys can get some reports done. Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna go to somebody's house. And by somebody's house... I mean... The, the dumpster. I guess. <laughs> I don't know. There's a bunch of houses over there, so that's why we're going to go over there. Sure, that sounds like fun. I love the junk shop. Great. We're going to go to the dumpster now. We're going to go to the dump. Cool. To the dump, 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 to the dump. Teach Eric. No, you're not teaching him anything, but you can teach him stuff. Okay. All right, we are at the dumpster with a lot of other people like Zelda and... Iliana. Okay, why are you running away, Kelly? Tell a friend how cool I am. No, greet her. Talk to her. We have to make friends with her and be nice. Jamie Yank. Why are there so many people at the dump? Oh my god, this this is glowing. Oh. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay, Kelly. Kelly, I'm trying to be friends with you. Oh good, Del Taco just taught Eric how to sit. Yay! Eric got taught how to sit. Nice. Okay, back to uh, Del. Now teach him another trick. Sit up. There we go. It'll be worth in the long run. Oh my god, it looks- this is my car! Why is my car here? <laughs> Sure, I guess. Why not? We'll talk to Chris. I don't know why Chris wants to talk to me, but whatever. Okay, brighten her day. Brag about your degree, because why not? Even though you both probably have it. Maybe she doesn't. I don't know. Play, play tag. <laughs> Discuss work. Yes. Enthuse about your new car. Get to know her. Do all of these things. Because you guys are going to be partners for a long time, probably. Unless I get promoted and then she's no longer my partner. Worry about money. <laughs> okay, no, we're not going to go bowling. We're working. But first we need to be friends. I need to know everything about her. Joke about work. Yeah, that's good. Joke about professors. Uh, tell a funny story. Just do all of that. Salvage? The frick is that? Man, if we ever need scrap, I know where to go. This place is crazy. We probably should play video games or something together. I think that really gets the skill up. Alright, anyway. Let's quickly go to my parents' house and investigate them. <laughs> let's go interrogate my parents. Don't worry, they'll like it. <laughs> Alright, come on. Go here with group. I'm thinking of leaving soon. Okay, but I don't care. Anyway, I'm gonna go to my parents' house and visit them. Teach Eric to speak. No. No, you're not gonna cool down. Teach Eric to speak. Okay. Gonna get rid of that. Because that's more likely- No, I don't wanna go to Dell. Ah! Alright, so what do we need to do for this? Oh good, we have a great relationship now. That's good, even though we're still just acquaintances. Okay, reports. 
Get info by questioning any sim. Alright. Well, I'd like to question this guy. What are you doing outside uh, of my parents' house? They don't know you. I don't know you, Buster. And why are you- why are you disturbing the peace? You're disturbing the peace. I'm gonna arrest you. Can I do that? Can I arrest people yet? <laughs> Is that a thing I can do? My god, I don't want- Ask to turn? Oh, he's a vampire? That's not good. Smartphone. Shut up. Ignore. <laughs> okay, you. Friendly. I need to interrogate you. How do I interrogate you? Uh, study together, ask about career, no, none of this is right. Special, no. Mean, threaten to exploit weakness, shakedown. Question. Okay, I think maybe questioning is good, right? No, I'm not doing that. Okay, look, Tucker doesn't like you, I don't like you. Is questioning correct? It says to question. Okay, good. Hey, are you a bad guy? Can I, like, arrest you? Or something? No, I'm a good guy. I'm just out here shouting at things. Buster's going home. Well, frick. Okay, now I have to write up a report on the computer. About Buster. But first, I should probably dig through my parents' trash. Just in case. You know, I gotta go get some dirt on them. There we go. Hopefully they don't catch me. <laughs> don't worry, they'll never see me. They'll never see me. They'll never know I was here. Uh, Bone Hilda, uh, please just don't tell dad about this, okay? Don't, don't tell dad. <laughs> or mom. Preferably mom. Don't tell mom. Dad might be able to handle it. I don't think mom can handle it. Okay, I found some discarded scrap. Oh, dang, I'm rummaging a long time. Okay, I found some solid information on my mother. Oh my god. I can't believe it. I can't believe it's my mom and not my dad. But anyway, I'm leaving now. Oh, are you coming with me, partner? That's cool. Um, but you can leave, you know. I, the outing is over. Oh good, Eric learned how to sit up. Great, that's gonna be it for this, uh day, though, because, you know, you're getting tired. The dog, I'm sure, is tired. Yeah, he has to pee. He's hungry. Leave him be. How about you make dinner? That would be good. We don't have any groceries. <sighs> How about you go grocery shopping? Good thing the shopping mart is just always open. So go grocery shopping, please. Oh my god, I forgot we needed to do that. <laughs> I forgot we needed to do that. Anyway, Kelly, you can go home now, right? Please. Let me use the bathroom. Well, that was somewhat fun. Maybe next time we'll tear it up? Yeah, maybe, Kelly, but today was just for work. We were just meeting each other. Whatever. <laughs> okay, how's this dog doing? He's peeing. Good for him. Eating some food. Good. He knows what he's doing. Alright, uh, quickly just buy a couple of ingredients. Oh, I can shop by recipe. Of course. I, why is an apple required for peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Is it because there's no jelly? <laughs> Alright, whatever. Sure. I don't even give a dang. Okay, we can make ten peanut butter and jelly sandwiches now. That's great. Guess that's all we need, because we have no money. <laughs> we have no money. <laughs> Alright. Uh, Del, I'm gonna just teleport you home, okay? If anyone gets on my case for teleporting my sims, let me just tell you, you waste a lot of time just walking. <laughs> just just trust me, it's best that I teleport them. It's not a cheat. It's, it's a feature of the game. <laughs> Alright, let's throw all this in. And actually, maybe we should, uh, plant a few things. I mean, we do have Dell. She has plenty of free time, so maybe she could plant some of this stuff and, you know, it'd be good for us or something. So let's just plant some stuff somewhere. I don't know where. Just on this hill, I guess. Don't really have any space for a garden, <laughs> unfortunately. Okay, uh, 
How do I plant stuff? I need gardening skill level 7 to plant the cherries. Frick. Okay, and I can't seem to... Is it because it's in the wrong spot or something? Let me just put it on some flat land. Okay, I can plant the apple. I have to plant them on flat land. Oh, that's irritating. Okay, alright. Let me try... I guess I'll have to flatten my land. Frick. Oh god, what did that do here? Oh god, what have I done? <laughs> oh god, what have I done? Okay, don't worry about it, it's fine. Just smooth that out a little. Okay, everything's fine, everything's... Everything's fine, just... It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> Should I get, like, a staircase up there? Oh god! <laughs> Alright, anyway. Now we have a garden space. <laughs> I wasn't- I didn't want to do that, because I kind of wanted the terrain to just be hilly and not look stupid, but oh well. I guess it's just gonna have to look stupid. Okay, I need gardening skill level 5 to plant watermelon. Alright. There, go plant those three things. A tomato, a lettuce, and an apple. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Okay. Since your sister's doing that, how about you serve dinner? Peanut butter and jelly sandwich, because that's the only thing we know how to make from our days in college. <laughs> Got a level three in cooking. That's not too bad. What? Guard object. Okay. Have fun with that. Alright, and after you write... Uh, after you eat this peanut butter and jelly sandwich, you should write up a report on your mother. <laughs> Writing. Report on Vanille. I guess I didn't get enough stuff out of that other guy. Oh well. Okay, dealt. No, no, no. No basic workout. Don't. Don't you need to water these things? Dispose? I guess they're fine. Okay. Use the bathroom then. And eat a. No, don't do that. Eat a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Good meal! Great. Alright, this shouldn't take too long. When does your work? Your work is in 11 hours. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. And of course I don't have to worry about when Dell goes to sleep at all. Ooh, it's snowing! It's 80 degrees Fahrenheit. That still doesn't make sense. I swear my game is bugged out, but you know what? Whatever. Well, the picture's changed. Great. Oh, I remember that day when Bean opened, like, four gifts and I opened none. <laughs> Alright, go to sleep. After that shower. Bean's almost done with his report. Bean has written a basic report on Vanille. Great, yeah, 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 go to sleep, Bean. Bedtime! And the, uh, their laundry went into the hampers. Nice. Put more laundry in there. I think that was Dell's, but eh, whatever. <laughs> Dell can do laundry and take care of the uh, house while Bean is at work. Where did you get this teddy bear? Did you get that from the trash? <laughs> Bumble leaf. A newspaper. I don't. I don't want this. Fifty scrap. Okay, I think he did take this bear from his parents' house, so I don't- I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> Bean. Bean, I don't want this. <laughs> okay, I guess he has a toy bear now. Oh, great. <laughs> Just off in the corner. Uh, should I name it? Scott? No, I'm gonna name it... Garbo. Short for garbage, because <laughs> that's where it was found. <laughs> Cuddle time! Teddy bears make excellent sleeping companions from stuffed animal! Oh my god, I've never seen that before. What the heck? Or at least it's been a long time since I've seen that. I didn't know that existed. Oh my god, that's adorable. That's so cute. 
I love that. <laughs> okay, I'm glad you put the freaking teddy bear in your room. Now you get an extra boosted moodlet. Buy a water slide. We don't really have mm, the expenses necessary for that, Bean. Alright, keep sleeping. Oh, I should definitely set your alarm clock for work. Set alarm clock, Bean. Del doesn't need to set hers, because she, uh... I forgot to feed the fish. See, I told you, man, it's already gonna die. <laughs> it's already gonna die. Remember to feed your fish when you wake up. <laughs> They'll probably feed you at work. I almost said school. So how about you go play SSX? Get a little bit of your fun up before you go. Oh, the carpool for Bean will come in about an hour. I don't need a carpool. I have a car. I left my car at the junkyard. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. They're gonna scrap my car. Bean! Where did the car- Bean! <laughs> where did you put your car, Bean? Bean? Where did you put the car? Oh my god, it's not in the family inventory. Bean. Bean, this is the problem with absent-minded sims, man. They just leave their stuff everywhere. They forget they have stuff, and then they just leave it. Where did you put the car, Bean? It's not at your parents' house. Oh my god, is it in Dell's inventory? It is, thank god. Oh, Dell, you're a savior. Oh, Dell, you're a savior. Sure, you can go jogging today. I mean, what else are you gonna do? Alright, Bean. Phew, go to work. And work hard, okay? Work hard. Chat with partner, that's not too bad either. But I'd rather you work hard. You've got some good stuff going here with your reports and your partner. Just keep it up. Okay, Del is gonna feed her fish. Here you go, dorm. I definitely didn't forget your existence. Okay, do you need to water the plants now? Ten garden. The plant is currently dormant. Because of the snow. And I can't build a greenhouse right now because I have no money. Great! I left the peanut butter and jelly sandwiches out, so now they're spoiled, so that's a waste of food. It's okay, just go eat cereal. <laughs> Alright, that's the carpool for Bean. I don't know what to tell them. Oh, Bean's in uniform! I didn't get to see that! Oh, I hope he comes home in uniform, that's cute. Okay, there's a, a hill in our yard, and I just I need it gone, because it's gross. <laughs> There. I fixed it. I fixed the hill. It's all fine. Everything's fine now. My plants are dormant, so I can't garden them. <laughs> winter sucks. When's winter over? One day until spring. Okay, good. Okay. Cleaning up the cereal. Alright. Eric, how are you doing? You need to pee, and you're a little hungry. Okay, that's... That's fine. You can- you need to wake up. You need to pee. Let's get the needs up for this dog. Best thing about Sims 3 is that you can control the pets fully. I love that. Bean Taco went to work for the first time. Oh, hello, mailman. How are you doing? Lane Clemenston. I don't really like him. I don't like the look of him. He's lonely. But I mean, there's also too many people. Oh my god, he's so much like Dell. <laughs> Certain Sims may not feel too comfortable from being around large groups. I don't understand. He has he is hyper neat and loyal. Why does he hate people? I don't know. <laughs> oh, and you're on your computer. That's nice. I love their rooms. I really do. Excuse me, what? Eric Taco just gained a new trait because of the positive or re negative reinforcement? He's aggressive. F Frick! <laughs> no, why? What, train? What do you mean it was trained? I did not train him to be aggressive. <laughs> I, did, I did not train him to be aggressive. He growled at that mailman on, all on his own. He growled at that mailman all on his own. Go chew the hot dog. Jesus. Well, you know, Ariel was also an aggressive dog, and we still loved her, so... Anyway... <laughs> 
Okay, reinforcements. Pray for being aggress- No, being non-destructive. And can we scold him for being aggressive? Chase- He was chasing the mailman. Nobody told me he was going to chase the mailman. Okay. I'm praising you and scolding you at the same time. Eric, you gotta look at me. Eric, you gotta look at me. Well, this is not working. <laughs> okay, I, apparently I'm just scolding you. Now, I wanted to praise you for being non-destructive. Oh my god. You know, why are you backing up? Why are you backing up? I'm trying to praise you. There you go. Good job. Non-destructive trait. Yay! He will restrain himself from targeting your furniture. Great. That's good. That I like. He scolded. Oh, he didn't like being aggressive. <laughs> Go chat with your partner for the last couple of hours. Overworked. Ooh. That's okay. They're gonna be fine. You wanna befriend Abby? That's a good idea, actually. You probably should do that. Okay. I'll get rid of the guitar want. Befriending Abby is more important. Being is childish, which means he still likes to play with toys and have a lot of fun. You best make sure to keep him entertained. Yeah, okay. My mood's not very good. Uh, Bean comes home and Del's just in the front yard barking at her dog like a psycho. 